Right, wonderful people, lovers of freedom, good morning, good afternoon, good evening to each and every one of you. Welcome back to Let's Talk TV, your one and only YouTube platform. Where they're giving a back-to-back -back update on how things they be, on how things they share for Biafra land and beyond. Uh, if you're joining us for the first time, remember to subscribe and turn on your notifications too. Also remember to like and share this broadcast as it is hot. All right, my wonderful people, the latest one with the boss brains at the moment right now. We say, yes, so you don't reach that extent with uh, P-M-B-R-G-I-E, Simon Epa Njoko. As you all know him, has uh, been doing the biggest things that we all know that he is he will be able to do. And he has been conquering a whole lot of things that uh, people thought uh, he would not be able to do. And that is the truth of the matter. He is a man that would always stick with whatever it is he has sworn to do. And at this particular point, he has uh, broken boundaries. He has uh, done things that people did not expect him to do. He has uh, even uh, made sure that uh, people <laughs> that thought that uh, he would not succeed, the example, uh, hey, you, I don't need to call his name. Uh, hey, you know, as he did be, you know, as he did hot. Uh, as uh, these people thought that he will not make it in life, he has also um, showed them that anything they do, it is not uh, going to work out for them. It is not even going to end up well for them if they continue in that particular movement by AMB, BMB, GI is a man of uh, many words and a man of also many actions because, uh, because uh, before he actually does anything, he actually tells them, my people, this is what I'm going to do to you people. This thing now we think will actually stop. And if you now not take time, now so you go end do now. Yes, and the the good thing say is in a joke as usual as normal. And at the end, it always ends up that uh, he, he does something that would normally and always put them off guard because that is the kind of person he is. The PMBRGI is not a man that should be taken lightly on any note because he's a man of uh, um, action. He, he, Whatever he says he will do is always what he ends up doing. We have seen how the um, the Biafra Liberation Army has uh, done a whole lot, has uh, conquered a whole lot too. And then uh, we cannot say that uh, these people did all these things without the help of the PMBRGI. We can be rest assured. We can be 100 percent assured that this man pmbrgie was a man or is a man that was that is currently i would say that he's currently involved in everything that concerns the movement and they succeeded in everything that he wanted to do that is one thing that when we think about or when i remember what the pm has been doing uh, and people come about to talk or see some other things i just uh, look at it and be like uh, i don't think yeah, these people have even understood how things are at this moment or they, they i don't think they have come to understand the real issue with how things would actually work out once the pm or anytime the pm says something and actually works with it that is the truth of the matter the main thing is this the whatever the pm has said he will do is something he actually ends up doing and we know how the ipop dos and the the so-called president of the zoo country <laughs> my people whatever he actually wakes up to always end up doing how it does not always work out. They have put so many stunts upon the PMBRGIE. They have done so many things against him. They have decided to put him down so many times. And my people, I am here to let you know that none of these things have actually worked out. I, that is the truth of the matter. Most of it ended up not working out because, of course, the PM is not a man that can be trifled with or can be joked around with. He's a man that have decided that would say this is what he would do and he would actually do it. This is a man that has stuck with whatever he said says he would do and actually ended up doing it he's not a man that uh, should be joked around with because of course he is going to make sure that anything he says actually ends up working out that is the truth of the matter we will continue working forward nothing is going to stop our biafra self-referendum that is supposed to actually take place for the declaration of biafra in the december 2nd uh, yes i know that uh, if you've not been following up this should be something that you should have in mind that will surely take place See, the, 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 the fact that we are working towards, the fact that we have hopes towards the Biafra referendum, the fact that we have hope towards everything that comes with the Biafra uh, declaration is something every single person should have word of and should be ready for no matter 
matter what is happening around no matter what people come out and talk no matter what people say about it because of course we know we have a lot of enemies that are coming against us we know we have a lot of people that do not want the progress but that is why they are keeping the the the, the leader of the indigenous people of biafra amazi Ohamadike Indibo, Nam, they can't know they are keeping him there, but they cannot keep him for too long. He's a man that would surely escape. He's a man that would surely succeed and come out alive. Yes, my people, at this point, we'll let you listen to the broadcast of the PMBLGIE. Thank you. Announced. Then it is new. It is very, very new and tantalizing. Everybody wants to get his or her own share. Because this is a new idea and it is very very calling it is very very tantalizing so I want to have my own share the first phase is always like that now whether it has second phase third phase fourth phase fifth phase or whatever any amount the last phase I'm be the coco the last phase is always the 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 the, the, the um, how can I? The sherry. The sherry. The last phase is always is always a rush because you don't want to miss out. That is the, the target. Your target to rush to vote is that a hey, time is is you know is uh, is running out, and you don't want to miss out. Time is running out, and you don't want to miss out. So second phase, as we have only three phases, first, uh, second, and third, this second phase, in everything, not only uh, uh, in the referendum, in everything you do in life, if it's divided into three stages, second stage is always slow because the people who voted in the beginning will have their own time during the second stage to do uh, their own things. And other people who have not voted, who are still busy, in one thing or the other, we'll be waiting. Say, okay, we we'll we'll still have time. I'm going to do my own. I'm going to vote. We we'll still have time. Yeah, I think it's it's ending. You know, this the third phase. They said the third phase is beginning from in August. They are starting the third the third stage in August. So uh, this is June. Of course, I still have my time. You'll be waiting for that. You'll be waiting for the third phase because you are still busy doing something. But once the third phase enter, boom. <laughs> everybody in a hurry in a rush so we are expecting even higher amount of people even higher number of people to come out and vote during the third phase of the self-referendum so for the fact that you have between first and second stages over 40 people have already voted now imagine what will happen before the end of the second phase and the beginning to the end of the third stage. Imagine what will happen. So now, and as we all can see, over these 40 million Biafrans that have voted already, the intentions and aspirations of these 40 plus million people that have voted already is only but one thing which is freedom of the afra <laughs> so now that is what this statement is talking about so then hereby resolved this 24th day of june 2024 oeas they said they said there will be a emergency state of the union press briefing with the Biao GIE international lawyer, Dr. Levy, and the Biafra prime minister. Of course, Mazi Samanepa Njoku Odrizu Mangu Wan. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. This is, this is huge. This is really huge. This is very, very huge. Now, who are these... Um, who are these? Um, let us see who are these. Who are these? Who are these? O E A S. Who are these? O E A S. 
Let us see who are these o, uh, OEAS organization for um, organization of Imagine African States uh, OEAS. So, who are these OEAS? Let us see who they are. First of all, this is their um, their logo. The organization of Imagine African States, OEAS. Okay. All right, let's continue. Let's continue. Let us keep searching. Who are these OEAS? I think we have to go to their website and check who they really are. Uh, let's go to their website and check who they are, OEAS. If you have any idea of the OEAS, please let us know in the comment section, or of course, let me even, uh, let me drop the number, let me drop the number on your screen so that those of you who would want to call in and make your contribution will be able to call and make your you know contribution very very important if you want to say anything as i'm as i'm as i keep as i'm going as i'm uh making my research you have every opportunity to call the number is right there on your screen for you to call directly on whatsapp so you can of course make your contribution and tell us more now this is the website of the organization of emerging african states Organization of Imagine African States, they said about us. I'm not going to read a lot. I just want us to see what they are up to, what they can do, and what is this organization all about. You can see this is about us. The OEAS is a NGO, NGO dedicated through freedom in Africa. NGO dedicated true freedom in Africa. Our principles are encompassed, encompassed in the Washington Declaration of 2010. Our principles are encom encompassed in the Washington Declaration of 2010. This amazing document provides a roadmap for a free and prosperous Africa united in freedom the oeas is a registered non-profit corporation based in washington dc with a general assembly of states planned for juba south sudan then they say prospective member states and organization organizations seeking consultative seeking consultative status may contact us at our contact email address now this is uh, about about OEAS, the uh, organization for of Imagine African States. Now, what these organization? Of course, they are domiciled in Washington D.C. So, what they do? What they do is to help and push the narrative, the desires, the aspirations of every people in africa that want to be free from the colonial enslavement that is what this organization is all about as you can see here they also made mention of uh, uh juba south sudan so that is what they do and of course when they come out and recognize what you are doing it is not going to end in you know uh, in it's not going to end on top of their own table they are not just there to recognize you i still believe that there are still other things that they can offer there are still other things they can do in terms of push, pushing your narrative to the world as the Prime Minister of the BRGIE always say, and I quote, that 
our fight for freedom is multidimensional. Is multidimensional. As we fight on ground, we also fight diplomatically. Very, very important. Very, very important. Now, as if this is not enough, I have already made a record of these very, um, you, you know, of these very news that I'm bringing right now to your screen. I have already recorded it uh, during my pre-recorded broadcast this very evening, whereby uh, LA, LA Weekly, LA Weekly is currently reporting the Biafran matters at the moment in the United States of America. Biafrans, a people in diaspora longing for a home to call their own. Longing for a home to call their own. For hundreds and even thousands of years, Africa has borne witness to huge, huge moments in human history. Current scientific evidence points to Africa as the cradle of humankind and why there is a debate on where exactly in Africa humans first emerged. The continent still plays a central role in the origin of the human race. Africa is also a land of turmoil, a land of turmoil. With the West and East African slave trade unleashing huge devastation on the continent people, various colonial empires partitioned Africa among themselves. They partitioned Africa among themselves, started with their meeting uh, in, in um, in is it was it berlin berlin yes germany in 18 something they partitioned africa at our own absence without our consent they divided our lands they invaded us with guns and bullets in order to join us together that is the chaos you have today in africa now they say why the remaining local kingdoms waged war against each other Ethnic and religious conflict persist even in the post-colonial era. Now, let me bring you to this place. Let me bring you to this place. Yes. Look at here. They said, More than 50 years since the end of the Nigerian Civil War, the continuing ethno-religious tensions and underdevelopment in the region, in the region of Biafra, have resulted in a Biafran diaspora with millions of Biafrans leaving Nigeria for a better life overseas. In the United States alone, only in America, there are 4 million Biafrans. 4 million Biafrans. Do you know that there are some countries today, there are some nations Nation, I mean nations today that are not even up to 4 million people. Are you aware that there are some countries today that are not up to 4 million people? Even in Europe, in Europe, there are some countries that are not up to 4 million people in Europe. But we are talking about Biafrans, only the ones in America not all the american continent not all the north american continent we are talking about those in the usa united states of america alone the ones in canada are not counted uh, the ones in other north american countries are not counted now when you go to south america south american continent we are in millions over there we are in millions now, if you bring Biafrans in Europe as a whole, including those in, in, in Britain, we are more than 15 million in Europe. Now, if you go to other African countries, other African countries, all over African countries in, in Africa here, we have more than 20 to 30 million Biafrans outside in Africa alone. 
I'm telling you. Because only Biafrans in South Africa, I don't know if there are more than this 4 million. I don't know. I, I'm, I'm serious. I'm serious about this. I don't know. I don't know how many there are. Now, let's continue. They say there are 4 million Biafrans in the USA alone. Despite the country no longer despite the country no longer existing for over 50 for over five decades the dream for an independent state still remains with a biafra republic government in exile biagie declared in 2023 with finland based simon ekpa Njoku as its prime minister along with 200 cabinet ministers and liaison offices in many different countries especially those with significant biafran populations especially those with significant Biafran populations. Back in Nigeria, Biafrans have been holding civil disobedience campaigns in protest. What are these civil disobedience campaigns we have been holding in Biafra land that the United States of America media outlet has recognized? that very civil disobedience, the number one of them all, if not the, the only one or the main one, is the sit at home that the enemies have been fighting so hard to stop. <laughs> Are you paying attention? Somebody say Luxembourg is six, uh, 600,000. Thank you. Let me bring it to the screen. <laughs> that is what I'm saying. There are some countries, even in Europe, that are not up to 4 million. And somebody is telling me that Luxembourg is 6,000 people. And I learned, I, I, I read one, uh, one, uh, one thing, I don't know if it's a documentary or what, I don't know. They said that Luxembourg, Luxembourg is the, the, the is it the richest country in, the, in Europe? Oh. I don't know. There's something there. Is it the richest country or what? Something like that. Can you correct me, those of you that live in Europe? I, 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 I saw something sometime in the past that said that Luxembourg is... Oh, so another person said Malta is 400,000. 400, you see? <laughs> and that's funny. That's funny. Now, this Luxembourg that has 600,000... I heard that they are, I don't know if it's richest or what. There is something they, they control as the biggest in the world. Somebody say in the world, thank you. The richest country in the world. Not even America, not China, not uh, France, not Germany, not uh, United Kingdom, not Russia, not uh, France, not Dubai. <laughs> but Luxembourg, small Luxembourg, I don't know if they are up to my village. I'm not sure if they are up to my village. But they are the richest country in the world. I don't know if it's by, by GDP. Probably by GDP or something like that. I don't know. And they are 600,000 in population. And they have no oil. They have no oil. They have no gas, nor gold. Hmm? Now, in Biafra land, we have oil and we have gas. The gas in Izombe, many of you do not know the reason of the senseless buying of our people in Izombe over the years. The gas in Izombe, based on rating, is the largest gas deposit in entire West Africa. And since it is in West Africa, that means it is Africa as a whole. Because there is no any other country that has biggest gas in Africa than the zoo. If you join, if uh, 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 you, you put, you, you know, if you, um, if you match them with the with Biafra and Niger Delta, the, the, the Niger Delta, where they call Niger Delta. So if you match them together, no country has the biggest oil, in, if not in the world, 
in the world because i can tell you tell me how many states in russia russia is is deemed as the richest oil producing country in the world right good tell me how many states i don't know what they call in russia is it state or county or a uh, 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 province tell me how many states in russia today that produce oil in large quantity how many are there how many states produce oil in russia those of you that live in russia if you are here listening to me right now i need an answer how many states are producing oil in russia of course if you go to google today you ask the te top 10 oil producing country russia russia america america was told that the only place they have oil in america is in texas in texas so even if it's big or I, I i i i notice that states are big the american states are like countries but even if they are big but at least they are one state it is one state so but in the zoo do you know how many states producing oil in the zoo let me count them based on the you know the names given to them by the zoo River State is there. Cross River is there. Akwaibom is there. Imo State is there. Abia State is there. Um, Bayesa is there. Delta State is there. Edo State is there. I don't even know Ondo State is also there. Ondo State, I think Ondo State is among the Niger Delta. Ondo State, State is there. Now, Anambra State has been recently added. Oil is found in Enugu State, which we shared the uh, the video sometime in the past, around 2020 or 2021, where fire was, you know, uh, 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 was, you know, I don't know, I don't even know. They said there is huge depo uh, oil deposit or gas deposit under the ground because we saw the fire all of a sudden. Now. If you calculate all these states, there are about 12 to 13 oil producing states under the zoo. Now tell me, how many states? I don't know. It's like there's no, nobody, is, nobody, nobody from Russia is watching this uh, live broadcast. I'm looking at the comments. I'm, I'm waiting for people from Russia. I want to know how many states are oil producing states in Russia. How many states are oil producers in Russia? Let me know. Somebody said that's gas in Enugu. Uh, 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 uh. Ngwero ngwo mo biafra. Ngwero ngwo uyi change kwa afa gi. Oh, I find you a before. <laughs> so now, you see how many states? About twelve to thirteen. Yet they are not even rated among the top ten oil producing uh, 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 countries in the world because of what corruption and the, the the money from from the oil is not being shown, not just in the in the country but also among the citizens. It's not shown. So now you see. Enugu, uh, Enugu, they say Enugu is gas, fine. Very good and fine. The oil, the gas in Izombe is the biggest in entire West Africa. And if it's the biggest in, in West Africa, that means it's the largest in Africa as a whole. Of course, uh, I understand you are the one, Mars. I can see your picture. I can see that. So now, what is this look at this place they said biafrans have been holding civil disobedience campaigns in protest and what is that they sit at home that they have been fighting to stop for the past three years they failed the zoo government kept silent the southeast governors kept silent the Ohanes and Yoshi kept silent. All the politicians, House of Reps, Senators, everybody kept quiet. Nobody talked. They pretended as if the seat at home is useless. They pretended as if they, they don't care. We can sit at home till eternity. Who cares? Nobody cares. Now, 
some people were not aware that these people, these zoo politicians, and of course, the Igbo on Hanez and and other Igbo politicians, including the military, were all waiting to see what the DOS can do. Because ego before, ego before, no go be a food check, go be a faka, go be a fish, ego be to make sure that once this man is apprehended and rendition to Nigeria, nothing will happen. Nothing. We Sabo, don't want to see anybody to pim this idiot in Biafala, working with Ifan. In when the I South exposed East him in the year 2021, I, I told you that he is the Ifan you know, Use your command and pen manager everywhere. Make sure I don't know if any, let me just Make let me sure just do a, 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 a brief referendum sure to know how many people, how many civil, old people are uh, here, uh, 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 how many um, old timers. Uh, let's do a sure on and not here. Order. Do you remember when I exposed sure this criminal and I, I told Use your command the whole world that he is the campaign manager of Ifanioba and I showed you a, a certain page, a secret page that he's using to campaign for Ifanioba. How many of uh, you remember? Just be sincere. I want to know the old timers here. They came. Do gara 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 gara. Please, let us show them what it is. I'm not just going to find out. He's moaning. Instant loan on my... I, 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 I had to not be able to help him. They go full on it. Get it today. If you don't release my family cannon by the 9th of August, every nook and cranny of Biafra land will Four be different hacks that you can implement today to get more followers on Instagram without posting. We are, we are jumping up and down. I am the one Burianisi. If any, the Quisim Bukam Bukakambuzi. Burianisi, now shout on top of my voice on Biafra United channel. Now shout every day. Sit at home, can they use Makia? Until that very day, 9th of August. 2021, 2021. I made us sit at home. Everywhere was on fire. Everywhere. They never knew that such announcement could have, you know, gathered such mo such such momentum. They never knew that that move they, 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 they made would have gathered such momentum. Everywhere was completely locked down completely shut down including in Guacha and other places in the place they call south south those that bought them over call them immediately and ask them are you mad is this our agreement this is not our agreement <laughs> this creator right here just use these tips to gain over i must hear Chai. Oh, what the hell? Oh, I, I want to know the old timers. Please, if you have yeah, any mention your name, I'll call you. I don't know what you're waiting yeah. for. Who gets a maca? Yeah, that name looks familiar. Emmanuel, hey, you go look for a yoga. Emmanuel, I think that name also is familiar. Oh, go course, of course, is familiar. Charity Simon, Tony Wolf, a better car for Jemima, of course, is a familiar name. Chairman, but in the Bahotu, of course, he wouldn't have fallen. Okay, Cliff Eber, of course. Okay, okay, I can see, I can see. I'm not no, alone. The first thing they did, <laughs> I'm, I'm not alone. The first thing I'm not they alone. Did was, we are many here. They drew, they drew they drew on social media. You are welcome. You are welcome. High Center, of yes course, I can no see you. Referendum. I can see you. Um, said, okay, we are many. We are many. Want us to continue All right, we have to continue. Home. Now, this idiot, uh, 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 this very yes. good, uh, 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 if you want us to, to stop it, this I don't know if any of you remember what I'm saying right now. Was campaigning for Ifanio, but with a diff, with a fake account, hours, which I exposed him. Over of course, 000 he came out. Votes he came out. Mona boy, Mbem, Mbem, me buy his money, me, 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 Obukro. All of them. Edwin or something or Mapo Tanike. Yes. Ozbom me expose or Mapo Tanike. No, I did not record even up to ten. I watched a video where he said he was exposing me, telling Soludo to use my voice to to track me. He claimed that I, I am the same person with the boy they called. Um, and I came. What's the name I of that guy? If I knew, I would then, uh, about What's the name of that I guy? There's that guy, he said that I'm the same person with that guy, that I am disguising. Uh, post. Uh, he said I'm disguising with that guy. There's that guy. For them, I think I hope I remember his name. 
On ma pota ni ike. On ma pota ni ike by force. You no, know, no, no, no. Uh, it's not me. Uh, my name is Eguato. Uh, 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 I am not this person. <laughs> Mad people everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> now, now, he said all I say, all I'm saying is the truth. All I'm saying is the truth. Which truth? Which truth? King Solomon, think I'll be watching the comment to see the person who is going to mention the correct name. King Solomon, Benny, we thank you. Jim, uh, uh, uh for thank you yes on channel full everything so he said that i i was king solomon that is what he said he came out he was calling soludo on that video telling soludo to use my voice to track me down that i'm the same person with king solomon that is what he did because i exp i exposed his criminality with ifa nyoba mad people everywhere now let us talk about this idiot. He said what he's saying is the truth. What is the truth? Who have chosen to always stand by the side of film? Imagine. I don't know if you can't get a good idea. You can't get a good idea. Hey! You can't get a good idea. You can't get a good idea. You can't get a good idea. Because I understand that. The only thing that can give you freedom is truth. <laughs> Mad people. Anyway, I have not come here to expose him. I have come here to send a message to him. So let's let's continue listening to his to the to the rubbish he's talking. Irrespective of the word that he's using, let's listen to him. Because our Bible said if you know the truth, the truth will set you free. A question equal to a Bible. Okwa the same equin sugalu Jesus Christ see ya na na equin su quote to Jesus Bible na equin su quoted Bible for Jesus Jesus where where get behind me get behind me equin su quote to Bible so it's not a new thing and because of this. I want to make my stand known to all of you today. Okay. And I would like you to listen attentively. On my last two video, I made a pronouncement that if the leader of indigenous people of Biafra had PI in court, that's the, I think, three days ago, the court appearance of the leader of indigenous people of Biafra. If he eventually appear in court and refuse to tell us or to let people know not to tell 